you're telling me that she can make up this over one point deficit on this apparatus? Absolutely. She is, as I said at the top of the show, world class. She's good enough. This routine right here is good enough to have contended not for a medal in London, but for gold. Right here, big. Very nicely done. And this routine is capable of a 7.2 start value. And watch this. This is incredibly hard. She's going to do a layout with a full twist. She does that so well and so consistently. I've seen her in training twice a day since we've been here. I have not seen her come off the beam on that. But Tim, this is the combination that she could possibly get five tenths bonus just for the combination itself. She and puts she her won't. foot down. Put her foot down. And then do it again right here. She should get the connection there, but will not obviously get that one. And well, she looks a little bit. Uh, she's definitely a little bit nervous, and oh. you know she's only gotten a 6.4 start value at the national team training camps this year, but that 7.2 is almost a full point higher than any of her other competitors. As you mentioned, start value, it's then added to the execution score, so that can be at the best a 10. So 10 plus whatever the start value is for the score. Double pike dismount here. Pretty <laughs> solid routine. Yeah, still gonna get a very good score, but she can be actually much better. Okay, so what does that face mean? <laughs> that means it's okay. <laughs> Not great, but you know, of course you can always do better, but I think they'll take that. I mean, this is her first senior competition. She's just turned, you know, a senior competitor, and she's used to compete at international competitions, but it's all different when you're a senior competitor now. So this is one of her biggest tests right off the top. Very difficult. It's called an Arabian. And you see that little arm swing. This is going to be interesting to see if the judges will actually give her that connection. I don't think that they will. But this, she gets the connection. Wow, look at her feet. They were a little bit off, but she saved it in the air. Look at her toes wrapped around that beam. How many times you see these athletes, they can just hold on with their feet. A great double pike dismount for Caitlin, but she's actually capable of doing even harder. She does a full in dismount, which you know, will give her even more bonus points to that start value. So the capability for Caitlin Ohashi on the beam is extraordinary. 